Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. I'm your host Anna and my channel name is Only My Dreams. Today I'm going to be sharing with you some of these new fragrances that I received in the mail and some things that I'm ordering. Um, so let's go ahead and just dive in, okay? So the first one we're going to talk about is the Better Than Sex Perfume. This is a limited edition. It just came out recently. I was very intrigued by it and of course I had to have it. The bottle itself is like a piece of art, honestly. It's absolutely gorgeous. Um, the bottle is just amazing. It has these beautiful rosettes. It's like a matte gold. It even has the lions here. The little things go up. Um, absolutely gorgeous. It's just like a little piece of art, this bottle. And then it has this really pretty um, stone look to the top, which is plastic. And then the little matte, hot pink, better than sex little sign on it. Now let's talk about it, you know, very briefly. Because I've already sprayed this on myself. I've already rocked it for like two days, two or three days. I have. And it is an interesting scent. First of all, it is, it comes blasting out as a citrus scent. You would think better than sex. You would think something sultry, something smoky, something a little musky, um, you know, something a little deeper, richer. No, this is like, I feel that it would do very well during the summer and the spring. Um, it has a citrus note that comes out hard, just just beast mode and then after a little while it changes into something a little bit more calming a little bit more interesting um was i disappointed with this scent i was a little bit would i buy this again no but i'm happy that i have it in my collection um i think it's going to work well during the summer because it's a very citrusy scent um but there's nothing sexy about it <laughs> there's nothing sexy okay the next one I decided to purchase was um, Versace and this is the bright crystal it came in this beautiful box I also have already rocked this like for two days I, I tried it and um, there's another Versace one that I want to try as well and here it is I got the kit it was on sale I believe I got it from Alta. I got the Too Faced Better Than Sex right from their own website, Too Faced. And um, the Versace Bright, it's a beautiful bottle as you can tell, okay? I wanted to get the other one, the Noir. This is a beautiful floral scent. It's, it's, it's a nice, bright, clean floral scent. It makes you feel pretty. This is, this is going to be a very nice scent for the summer and for the spring, maybe heading a little bit into the early fall, but not deep into the fall. Um, but this is a scent I think that's going to work really well in warmer weather. Um, it wasn't really doing too much for me during these cold days, but it was a nice, clean, floral scent, and um, it's a nice piece to my collection. I told you this is going to be first impressions, honey. Okay. Then I did go, I have more to share with you, so make sure you come back from Bath & Body Works. I just happened to have this one in my purse and I pulled it out. I did go to Bath & Body Works. I took advantage of their 70 and 80% off sales, so I did pick up a lot of things, so make sure you come back. And this one's called Love Cotton Candy Champagne, and this is a body mist. Um, I did get two of them. I couldn't find a large size of this. I could not even find the lotion for it or a shower gel. This was it. For this particular line and you guys this smells like what some people said it smells almost like strawberry shortcake the doll um, that's what it reminds me of um, cotton candy yes with strawberry on it like the strawberry shortcake doll that's what it kind of reminds me of I really love the sweetness of it it's a very fun scent, very sweet gourmand. You really have to be into the sweetness because it's very sugary. And for a spritz, it does last for a fairly long time. I was very surprised at the amount of time that I could still smell it afterwards. But it's the kind of scent that you spray and it just makes you smile because it's so candy-like, cotton candy. But it also reminds me of the strawberry shortcake doll. Okay, so there you go. And it's called Love Cotton Candy Champagne. The next one. Um, I got these from um, Fragrance Net. I did get the tester for Boucheron. I have not tested this. I'm going to do this with you right now. This was a scent 
that I had found as an oil before many, 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 many moons ago. I used the oil and I fell in love with it. So I was like, let me get the tester because it was cheaper. You never know if the tester is going to come with a lid or not. You just, and yay, it came with a lid. So it did come with a lid. Yay, look. She looks brand new. Sometimes these testers come without a lid. So you just get the fragrance. Let me see. You just get the fragrance like this. Um, not even normally with a little tag or anything. It just comes, you know, like this without the lid. But it came with the lid. Okay, so let's try her out. I'm just going to spray it right here. A little bit right there. Oh, my gosh. Oh, this is heavenly. Oh, Boucheron is such a heavenly scent. And I got the big one, the 3.3, because I knew I loved the oil, and I was hoping that it was like the oil, and it is. This scent is absolutely gorgeous. I mean, the bottle is beautiful within itself. It looks like a little, you know, just like a little piece of work, artwork. But the scent is a beautiful floral. It has, I can smell like the orange, the bergamot in it. It has like a creamy, a creamy feel to it. Oh, but there's something, there's something back there in the back that just wants to pull you in. It has like a sexiness to it as well because it does have a little musk in here. Maybe a little amber. Oh. This scent is enchanting. I absolutely love this. I'm so glad I got it. And it was the tester. Ah, oh, I'm so glad that I got it. And it came in a plain little box. Sometimes testers just come by themselves without a box. And no cap. I'm so happy that it came like this. Oh, my gosh. That is absolutely, absolutely beautiful. I am so happy I finally got it. Okay, the next scent. It is, um, let me close up the box so you can see the box briefly. This is Lolita Lempica. I'm um, so sweet. I I don't know if this is my first scent from Lolita Lempica. I think it might be. And it was on a good price and I wanted to try it. So I got the smaller bottle. This is a one fluid ounce, um, the EDP and du Parfume. And she looks like a little beautiful apple with a little bite out of it. it. looks like a heart, though. And it says so sweet. And you can even see the top. It's like a matte gold. And it has almost like a wood look, bark look to it, and then the stem. Okay? I've never tried this scent before. Okay, so there's the sprayer right here on this stem. Okay, that was very different for me. Okay, so that's the sprayer right here. Let me see if I can put it over here on this piece of, so I can smell it. Okay. That is so different, right? Clothing, but it smells like a nice, sweet, gourmand, floral type of a fragrance. It has like just a tad bit, just just a touch of musk, just a touch of musk. Then the last one that I have is Delicious Cotton Candy. And this is by um, Gail, Gail Hammond's Beverly Hills. And they have some really interesting scents. The bottle itself, I've never tried this. The bottle itself is insane. It's pink. It has this panther like on a rock. She has a few scents with this panther on top, which is a piece of art. It's just absolutely gorgeous to look at. Very pretty. If you see it in person, it's almost translucent. You can almost see right through it. You can see all the details of the hair of it too. Oh my gosh, my video just stopped. Okay, so I sprayed some on my, on my hand and you guys, this smells so sweet. It could be a lot, like a little bit too sugary for some of you because it smells like pure candy, like pure cotton candy. It's just so sweet. But it smells good and I like it. I think I'm probably going to try to mix this up with like a vanilla and like intertwine them. But that is a, that is a wonderful scent. I like it. 
but it's very, very, very sweet. That's why it's called Cotton Candy, and I love the bottle. So I hope you all enjoyed my new fragrances, and make sure you come back, check out the Shein haul and all the other wonderful um, things I'm going to be sharing with you. I'll see y'all later. Bye.